So I'm going to show you how to use tabs when you're browsing the internet. The time I use it most is when I'm searching for something. And I usually use Google as my search engine. So let's suppose that I'm after booking a holiday in Greece. I type that in and click on Google search. And it gives me lots and lots of options where I can find out a bit more. Now I could just click on the first one, read it, then come back again, then click on the next one, read that, and so on. But it would be easy to lose track of where I was. So instead, what I can do is look down the list, find one that sounds interesting. Let's have a look at this one. And instead of clicking on it, I right-click on it. And from this little menu that pops up, I choose Opening New Tab and click on that with the left mouse button. The new tab opens up, up here at the top. But I stay on the same screen so I can carry on looking down, see if there are any more that are interesting. Let's have a look at this one as well. And I right click on that one, choose open a new tab, and that one opens up as well. Then I can keep going And if there are some others that are interesting, I can open those as well. Then when I'm ready, I click on the tab I want to read, just once with the left hand mouse button, and it takes me to that one. I can have a read of that. And if I've finished with that one, I can close it by clicking here on this little cross. It still leaves the other tabs open it just closes the current one. Then I can read the next one and I can still click on links just as normal just by clicking once with the left mouse button. You can even use the right click and open a new tab trick from one of these. It's quite a simple little trick, but it is useful when you're searching for something like booking a holiday or buying something online and you want to compare different shops. Or even just if you're researching something because you want to find out about it and you want to read up on what it says on different websites. If I want to create a completely new tab, for example to look something else up while still keeping these ones open, I click here on this little narrow tab. And there we are, a completely new tab for me to do whatever I like in. I'll show you how to do that in the new browser from Google called Chrome as well. It works in a similar way, but it looks ever so slightly different. So let's search for the same thing. Just as before, I can right click on one of these and select open link in new tab. It's the first option now rather than the second option that it was in Internet Explorer. As before it'll open a new tab over to the right but I'll still stay on the same screen for now. If I want to create a completely new tab I just click on this plus symbol and straight away it creates a new tab.